chlorella and its health benefits. Chlorella is considered a superfood and contains an abundance of nutrients. It's also a type of algae that thrives in fresh water. The entire plant can actually be used as food or medicine. And some research actually shows that it can also be biofuel. Chlorella available in the US typically comes from Japan or Taiwan. And because of its hard cell wall, processing must take place to make it into tablets or liquid extracts. And a lot of times this cultivation, harvesting, and processing can differ in the content of these extracts. And so there are two types of chlorella, chlorella vulgaris and chlorella pyrenoidosa. Um, there are really good health benefits of chlorella as it can deal with many things from bad breath to reducing asthma to helping protect the body from heavy metals and detoxification. It is a great source of nutrition and contains 50 to 60% protein and has all nine essential amino acids to make it a complete um, superfood. So chlorella also supplies 6 to 40% of our daily need for iron and it contains really good amounts of vitamin C that is able to help your body also absorb iron. It also contains a variety of antioxidants and minerals. And even three grams of the superfood can actually provide 100 milligrams of omega-3s. So it's a very good source of fiber in addition. Chlorella has been used to assist in detoxification of uh, heavy metals, meaning it's a great binder and helps the body get rid of heavy metals and its toxicity to the brain, the liver, and the kidneys. It can also be a really good uh, strengthener of the immune system. And it helps also to control uh, cholesterol levels, whether it's the lipids or the triglycerides. Um, some studies show that it, taking five to 10 grams a day can actually lower your LDL cholesterol and triglycerides. It lowers cholesterol because it has so much fiber and antioxidants to be able to protect the heart. The antioxidants in chlorella include lycopene, lutein, vitamin C, chlorophyll, and beta carotene. And so these antioxidants actually inhibit the production of things we call advanced glycation end products or ages. And ages is what usually promotes um, aging and <laughs> so the antioxidants actually help prevent that from happening. Chlorella can also help to control and improve blood sugar levels, um, reduce uh, respiratory inflammation, increase aerobic endurance. Uh, it can also have some potential protection against um, worsening brain mental decline and help remove xenoestrogens or BPA that can be found um, in many contaminated soils. How do you use chlorella? Studies found some beneficial effects with as little as 1.2 grams per day and others actually showed 5 to 10 grams per day. So it really depends on your body and the ability to ramp up and the ability to detox. Always ask your doctor about the dosing, Always ask an experienced provider to see what dose is good for your body because you want to make sure that you don't over detox and have detoxification reactions. And so the risks and the side effects is that you have to be careful in the immune response and be careful of um, blood uh, clotting because chlorella does contain high levels of vitamin K. So make sure you're not on any blood thinners like warfarin or any other medications that might interact with chlorella. Um, it can have some nausea or abdominal discomfort in some people and make sure not to use it if you have any severe reactions to chlorella. And if you have experienced allergies to molds, this chlorella may also increase that risk and always be careful of too much detoxification like we talked about.